Hello there everyone, welcome back to Ants Authority. Today we will discuss about the topic Can Ants Live in Your Hair? In this video, we will discuss about this topic in detail, so let's start the video. Ants can nest in your hair because they are a good source of protein. These get attracted to the greasy scalp, dandruff, sweet odor of shampoo or conditioner and fermented hair. Big-headed ants are known to cause alopecia in vertical or circular patches. Ants can reach strange places while searching for food when the external temperature is favorable. They live in trash bins, food trays, sinks, bird cages, and even in human hair. Probably you are providing a suitable nesting spot to ants unknowingly if you do not keep your scalp clean and free of dandruff as sweat and dandruff can attract them. The head scalp contains oil glands which can help keep hair healthy by reducing dryness. However, the situation gets complicated when these glands become overactive and release excessive sebum. In addition, scalp appears greasy within a day or two after washing it. It can occur due to a deficiency of essential vitamins, mainly vitamins B6 and B2. This greasy scalp can attract grease ants as these insects get attracted to oil. Accordingly, they can build a temporary nest on your head for nutrition. Ants like to eat dandruff flakes because they are easier to carry on bodies or fix between mandibles due to their lighter weight. In addition, these flakes are a rich source of nutrients and energy for these insects. Accordingly, they can reach the carpet searching for dandruff flakes or even begin living in your hair. You can get rid of them only if you solve an issue of dandruff, otherwise they will not leave your head and build a temporary living spot there. Hair conditioners like rose, coconut, butter, etc. have a pleasing odor and a peel insect receptor. They get attracted to beautiful fragrances so ants can get on you when sleeping. They can reach your head easily by climbing the bed and hiding between the strands. It is easier for ants to hide and nest in the curly and thick texture then straight and frizz free hair. Moreover, these insects feel comfortable until you do not interfere with their nest. They cannot make a permanent living spot on your scalp because frequent combing and washing can cause discomfort for them. Many of these insects cannot live on the scalp because they get detected by a person who will keep combing until all of them get out of his head. These insects can only attack your head and they can also reach bathroom drains in search of keratin strands usually present on dirty drains. Moreover, the broken strands on the shower drain smell like rotten and not clear receptor, but the allure ants and them inside. Fermenting hair can become a good source of nutrition for them and they can reside under the drains to remain closer to keratin protein. So it is better to remove hair from drains if you want to get rid of ants from your bathroom because they can build a permanent nest in the drain clogging. They can create a problem after nesting in your hair by biting the scalp and making wounds on the affected spot. Some insects can even stink and inject venom into the scalp. These insects are responsible for alopecia or hair loss from a specific area in different directions. You can get a circular or non-discrete patch on the scalp due to localized destruction. A few people have been diagnosed with such problems due to ants nesting in their heads. However, only a few of these insects usually live there, ranging from 2 to 3. This destruction can become prominent over time if you do not sort out issues like a flaky or greasy scalp. It rarely happens that these pests have moved to your head, but it is observed. In addition, it can cause a lot of discomfort for the person carrying insects on his hand and create panic. Broken strands can regrow as they do not remove strands from follicles but break apart. Mechanical pulling or chewing and chemical secretions by their mouth can hydrolyze the strands and break strands into two halves. They will take a few weeks to regrow to their original length. Thanks for watching the video.